Hello friends, welcome to risingpearl.com. Let's take a look at how do we solve question number 11. So the question number 11 goes like this. So in the figure below, we have been given a figure. O is the center of a circle such that, so we have a circle and O is the center of the circle such that the diameter AB, so we have a diameter, so AB is a diameter and the measure of AB is the length is given which is 13 centimeter and AC is another line whose length is given as 12 centimeter. So it looks like we have a circle and AB is a diameter passing through the center, all the diameters have passed through the center and C, they have not talked anything about C except that the length AC is 12 centimeter and simply B and C are joined, that's fine. Now find the area, we have to find the area of the shaded region. So, it, so we have this shaded region highlighted in blue. We have to find out the area of the shaded region. So how are we going to do this? So the first thing that we should know is that any angle in a semicircle. So if AB is a diameter, so C is any point in a semicircle because then the arc ACB is a semicircle and we know from, there is a theorem that says any angle in a semicircle is a right angle. So by that, this will be 90 degrees. And as I have been doing in all of these questions, I'm going to provide any appropriate theorem as you solve these questions on the upper right hand side corner of these videos. So if you can simply click on the upper right hand side, it will list you all appropriate theorems that relate to the particular question that we are solving. So if this is a right angle triangle, then what is given is we have, we know the length AB. AB is given, this is 13. And similarly, AC is also given. The length of AC is given as 12 centimeter. So then what is missing is BC. So if this is right angle triangle from Pythagoras theorem, we can say if this is 90 degree, opposite to 90 degree is the hypotenuse. So AB is hypotenuse. So AB square will be equal to AC square AC square plus BC square. So if we simply put the values, so if this is 13 square plus AC is given as 12 square plus BC. So from here we can fi we will find out that BC square will be equal to if you multiply 13 times 13 you will get 169. If you multiply 12 times 12 you will get 144 and if you subtract you will get 25. So from here, what we will know, we will see that BC is square root of 25, which is equal to 5, right? It is plus minus 5, but obviously this length cannot be negative. So BC is 5 centimeter. So we have found out BC is 5 centimeter. So BC is 5 centimeter and AC is 12. So if you, if you think about the area, let's do one thing. Let's give ourselves a little bit more space. So what we know is that now this length is 12, right? And BC we have just seen is 5 centimeter. Now, what is the area of the shaded region? So we can think about the shaded region as the area of the entire semicircle minus the area of the circle. That means the area of the shaded region, area of the shaded region, is equal to area of semicircle. Obviously, you're going to write it much nicely than the way I'm writing it. So the area of the semicircle, so if you think about this entire area, let's see if I can actually highlight this here. It may make it a little bit more confusing. But if you think about the area of the entire semicircle as I am showing in here, right, minus the area of triangle ABC. So if we find out the area of the entire semicircle and subtract the area of the triangle from this, if this is the area of the triangle, then clearly you will be getting the shaded region, right? So now we know that AB is a diameter. So that means AB is actually 13, right? So that means 2R, if R is the radius, 2R is equal to 13. So from here, radius is 13 by 2. So area of a semicircle, the formula is pi R square. This is the entire area. 
divided by 2. This will give us the area of a semicircle minus area of any triangle is half times height times base. Height is AC times base is BC. So at this point, we know all the values, right? So this will be pi R is 13 by 2 square divided by 2 minus 1 by 2 times 12 times 5. So if you just simply solve this and here in the question they have given us that we should use pi as 3.14. So if you do this, you are going to see, let me see if I can actually come in here. So area of the triangle you will see will be 30 centimeter square, right? It will be half height base, half AC times BC, half 12 times 5, it will be 6 times 5, 30 centimeter square. Area of the shaded region will be area of the semicircle minus area of the triangle, area of the circle pi r square minus area of the triangle, pi r square by 2, area of the circle divided by 2, minus area of the triangle. So 20, 22 by 7 times pi r square, 32 by 13 by 2 whole square times half. So this will be 66.33 minus 30, it will be 36.33 centimeter square, 36.33 centimeter square. That will be the area of the shaded region. This is how we solve question number 11.